Uh, thank you very much, Mr Speaker. Um, the facts here are that Billy Calder was family had not taken this to the limits of the weekend, the government would still be sitting on their hands. The good news is the government, for the first time, acknowledged the therapeutic value of medical cannabis. I am asking the government to expand this to people suffering from multiple sclerosis, Parkinson's and certain cancers. It is happening in 30 of the states, United States and 12 plus countries in Europe are already doing this. I am asking this government to legislate to bring forward medical cannabis under prescription in the United Kingdom. Well, the Honourable Gentleman is expressing a view that I think is, is, that is held in many places across the House that legislation needs to be revisited and that this is the right place uh, uh, to debate that. I, I refute what he was saying about the Government uh, sitting on its hands in, in, in relation to the Billy Corwell case. We worked very hard during the week to try and find solutions to a very difficult situation, but the Government is always going to be bound by the rules of, of the day, whatever uh, people uh, think about them. I'm just very glad. Uh, that we could find a temporary solution uh, for Billy and, 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 and I hope that that's a step towards the long-term solution he deserves.